Hi, I'm Stuart Shepard. This is Stoplight. Do I look like a person to you? I'm always amused when an activist group comes up with a meme that they believe is brilliant and it turns out to be about as brilliant as giving a $14 million book advance to Hillary Clinton. Here's one. The euphemistically named People for the American Way took this photo of the front of a Hobby Lobby store and added the banner, does this look like a person to you? Uh, nope, that's a building. However, what they're trying to say is that once people organize as a company, they have no First Amendment rights. Let's try out that logic. Here's the skyscraper that's home to the New York Times newspaper. Does this look like a person to you? Nope, building. But the people who work in this building enjoy the First Amendment right to freedom of the press. What about down the street at 30 Rock, home of NBC and MSNBC? Building? Yeah. But the people who work here also enjoy that whole freedom of the press thing. You may not recognize this blank looking office tower in DC, but does this look like a person to you? No? It's a building? Well, somewhere in there you'll find the offices of People for the American Way. And as an organization that employs people, they still enjoy the First Amendment right to free speech. Even speech that's more ironic than brilliant. How is it that left-leaning news outlets and organizations can readily lay claim to the First Amendment right of free speech, but then use that right to say that Christian business owners and Christian nonprofits have no First Amendment right to the free exercise of religion? Let's go back to that Hobby Lobby picture. Still a building, huh? Well, that's because it's the wrong photo. Here, what if instead I show you a picture of the Green family, the owners of Hobby Lobby? Yep. Those look like American people. 